Hello and welcome to the AFL Auto Blends 3D Car Creation Channel. I have set this channel up to, to share with you my passion for automobiles of all ages, from real cars to model cars to radio control cars. This channel will feature 3D design creation in Blender for CGI or 3D printing purposes. It will also feature my view of TV car shows giving you critiques on, on various car shows and which ones to watch and not watch. It will also feature my view of historic car racing and include footage. This video though is based on my latest task of 3D printing a readily available Audi R18 taken from Thingiverse which, is create, which was created by Brett Turnage. I will also post subsequent videos in time when I've completed sections of the build. Um, basically in front of me I've got the instruction manual which I've um, downloaded from, from Thingiverse. You'll, on Thingiverse you'll find all the parts that you need to, um, to, to able to 3D print. This instruction manual also includes um, details on how to build it, what parts you need, whether they be printing, or or printed parts or purchased parts okay so there's a typical picture of the uh, of the chassis um, and there's various other pages um, and ex explanations etc um, culminating with what you see on the front cover um, I've started creating it and that's where where I, where I am at the moment with the chassis I've also created other 3D printed parts, i.e. the wheels. Um, this, this model will be in a one-tenth scale. Um, I've also purchased various bits and pieces. Um, like in front of me now, it's a differential. Um, you buy the differentials and you uh, create it. There's a decent set of instructions for that. Um, there's also other bits and pieces that I've purchased. Um, over the wall. It will all be um, on the uh, on Thingiverse. Um, in the I'll, in this video, I'll include links to any relevant um, parts that we've discussed on the video, i.e., Thingiverse. Um, in future episodes, I will be going through the cars I've created in Blender, the cars I'm working on, um, my plans for what to do with those cars. A lot of people um, tend to do car modelling for um, for CGI, for computer graphics and uh, for games. Well, I look at it from a different angle completely. I want to create these cars and turn them into radio control cars. I want them to be as realistic as, as possible, i.e. so there'll be lots and lots of parts on all these cars. Um, there'll be doors that a hinged and open and shut, um, there'll be chassis completions, there will be um, I'd say the engine bay um, detailing, interior details and various things um, that ideas I have that, um, that you can turn a model created in Blender um, and print it out in, in, in real life as a one-tenth scale car. You don't have to print it out um, for 3D purposes. You could actually print these out um, a smaller version, smaller scale versions, and just as a model that you put on your on, on, on your um, desk or whatever. Um, so all these things um, I hope to help you with over the course of these videos. I'm very new at um, at starting these videos that's why I'm, I'm in an hour in a little bit um, but I do intend to improve and improve the content of what I'm, I'm giving you um, I will also help mainly beginners um, up to intermediate learners on blender and encourage you to use it uh, for instance um, I've recently retired so I'm not young um, I learned blender around three years ago um, I was very fortunate in having a stepson that works in the 3D industry. Um, he 
sort of told me about 3D printers and 3D printing and what you could do with 3D printing. Um, to that end I bought one um, and he helped me assemble it and with trial and error I sort of learnt my way on it. And on Thingiverse you can, you can pick up all sorts of useful items and probably not so useful items that you can print um, basically that have already been designed. So it's limitless. It's limitless with the with what you can achieve with Blender. Blender's not a very easy program to learn, but my advice is stick with it. There's plenty of good tutorials on there. Um, in these videos, I will be recommending um, certain people that, that, that have, I've learned a hell of a lot from in terms of modeling. Um, and point you to some very good tutorials, some of which you pay for um, and some which you don't, which are free. Um, but there's some really good uh, computer graphic artists out there, some very good tutorials. I will be trying to teach in layman's terms um, some basic information on, on Blender, so i.e. beginner stuff. If you if you want to get in, if you're interested in that, just um, ping me a note and um, I'll see what I can do um, just to get you going basically but I've learned a hell of a lot and I hope to help people to understand what I've learned and to get them into this wonderful hobby um, please hit the like button and the, scri and the subscribe button if you're new um, thank you